This is very overrated and disappointing. Very overrated and disappointing. But yeah, um, so, no Breath of the Wild 2. Uh, Skyward Sword HD, uh, actually, no, it's Skyward Sword SD. You know what, um, yeah, that was shit. SD. Um, yeah, SD, standard definition. It's not HD, that does not look HD. Tell me that looks HD. Come have some Sandy and, and, and uh, and, and called SD, not HD, because... That did not look HD to me. It was bloomy as fuck. It literally looked like the Wii game. It looked hella bloomy. If you compare Twilight Princess GameCube and Twilight Princess HD on the Wii U side by side, they actually look different. They look much better graphically. Uh, graphically. But no, instead we have uh, we have uh, shitty, bloomy, uh, like oversaturated Skyward Sword. The art style was okay, but like, god, it looks like very bloomy, and I hate it. It's disgusting. They should have done something to fix it, but they didn't. They just made it look moody again. They just made it look moody, and it makes no fucking sense to me at all. Like, come on, guys. Like, yeah, this Smash announcement was okay. It's Pyramithra. I mean, hey, a lot of a lot of the Xenoblade fans got fan service, but like, come on, guys, really? That was disappointed as fuck. You ready for Mario Golf Speed Golf tournaments? Um, maybe. Maybe. But yeah, Mario I'm Golf's the only thing Golf. I saw that interested me. And then, uh, I might get the Zelda Joy-Cons because I'm a fanboy. But honestly, I might not. I already have, like, eight pairs of Joy-Cons that I have, like, collected upstairs. And I don't need them. I don't need, like, honestly, I don't care. This Direct was shit. Uh, 2021's just gonna be a bad year. And I really don't care. I was expecting something 35th anniversary re related, and we got nothing. Age of Calamity DLC. I can just emulate it. Um, Splatoon 3. can just emulate it. Um, there are so many games out there. It's just like, why would I pay $60 for it if it's not a big deal? Like, come on, guys. Make, make it actually interesting to me to get. But I, I see nothing interesting about it. I see nothing interesting about it. I'll just I'll just play Skyward Sword on the PC on Dolphin and use high res textures and it'll look better than the Switch version. That's kind of sad to say. That is very sad to say. Very sad. But it's true. It's true. I can literally make the game look better by putting HD textures into it, by injecting HD textures, and it'll look better. It's sad. It's very sad. Like, come on, Nintendo, you should do better than that. But they're not. They're lazy. They have learned that they can get away with people buying their games. It's why 3D All-Stars did relatively well. It's it's why it's it's why the online service is so shit. And I've heard they're improving it fucking finally. But I guess that's why Splatoon 3 is coming out, because the online is supposedly going to be better. I don't know if that's gonna be true or not. But we can hope. We can only hope. And even then, if it if it is better, I may get it. But honestly, I don't I don't see a point in wasting sixty dollars on a game that I more or less bought like I don't know, five four years ago. I, I don't see the point, man. Call. I don't see the point. But it's it's a new game. It's a Splatoon game. I have Splatoon already. Your point. I'm willing to get Mario Golf, uh Mar yeah, Mario Golf is the only thing that I might actually buy. Because it at like if they have if they have the spin mechanics and they have the RPG mechanics, if they have RPG mechanics from uh what have you, if they have RPG mechanics from Mario Golf Advance Tour, MGAT, if they have those mechanics, which I saw they had them. Um if that's all fully fleshed out, I may buy it just for that because goddamn I loved Advance Tour for that for that uh for that idea but like other than that if, if if there isn't backspin or topspin or any of that if there isn't spin mechanics or if there isn't impact mechanics i'm going to be very disappointed and there that that will mechanics. that will literally break my heart because that's the whole purpose of playing the old golf games is is the impact mechanics and shit like that yeah there is impact mechanics yeah but uh yeah skyward sword on switch but it looks like shit Skyward Sword on Switch literally looks like that. Yeah, they should have added in left-handed settings. Hey, lefty gang. Lefty gang represent. Who in chat's lefty? Who in chat is lefty? Please, I ask. Who in chat is lefty? Because, uh, I am. I'm, I'm lefty. You're lefty? 
I don't know whether I am right or left. You're ambidextrous then. All right. I'm not left, but my brother is. Yeah, there are quite a few of us. There are quite a few of us lefties out there, and it's just like, come on. Come on, guys. The the game is very hard biased to righties, and like... I mean, sure, hold on a second. Hold on a second. I write with my right, but I do also do stuff with my left. Hold on. Alright, here's my nunchuck. It's knotted and all that shit. Wow, Adam, that's mean of you. That's mean of you. Lefties well, for the win. What do you say? He said, I'm the superior race, right? <laughs> meanie! Yeah, he's a big meanie. What's the term for, like, um, being able to do with both hands? Ambidextrous. Ambidextrous. But yeah, Ambidextrous. guys. I can hook this up right now. I can hook this up right now. Also, you see how I have my Wii remote in my left hand? It's because I'm lefty. But yeah, um... I'll basically have to do this. I'll have to do this, and this seems very, uh, like, South Paul to me. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna have to do this when I play, uh, Skyward Sword, and it's not gonna feel right. It's not gonna feel right. It's not gonna feel right. But, but, hey, Gary, how's it going? But yeah, like, I normally play Galaxy, I believe, like this. And now I have to do this to play, uh, Skyward Sword. Yeah, I'm seeing a lot of righties in in uh, in chat, but uh, some of them some of them are lefty. It's the war of the consoles: right station, left box, and ambidextro. Wow, wow. But yeah, literally, I can set this up on my PC right now, and I can go play Skyward Sword. Dead ass. Like, come on, Nintendo, you gotta do better than that. You gotta do better than that. Also, I do want to get one of the gold Wii motes, but those are expensive. Gold Wiimotes? Yeah, there are gold Wiimotes for Skyward Sword that were released in like 8 years- No, 10 years ago at this point. Almost 10 years ago. Wow. But yeah, I don't see- I don't see a point, man. I don't see a point in getting uh, Skyward Sword HD. It looks gloomy as fuck. It does not look like an HD game. It just looks like a port job. A gold mm -hmm. remote is better than the joy cons Agreed. Agreed. Very much agreed. Hell, I'd rather 3D print some, like, models that you can, like, put the Joy-Cons in and then have a Master Sword in one hand and a shield in the other made out of, like, 3D printing material. I'd rather do that. I'd rather, like, make a physical, like, controller handle or something, but, eh, they don't care. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I don't know if I want to play it or not, but honestly, if enough people want to see it, if you guys want to see me play, uh, Skyward Sword, do you guys want me to do a poll? Because I'll do a poll. Here, let me do a poll. <laughs> Ask if you want to do a poll. It nearly does a poll anyway. Should I play Skyward Sword HD on my PC? Yes. And I'll help you. No. It's Fuck a... Skyward. It's a bad <laughs> game. No, fuck Skyward. Should I play Skyward Sword HD on my PC? I vote abstain. <laughs> well, you can you can abstain. That's right. Uh, I don't want to get there. myself. Yeah. Um. They got left hand scissors, dude. Gary. I have some lefty scissors. You can actually uh. You can actually see, it says lefty, if it focuses. But yeah, these are lefty scissors. That that font right there says lefty, you can barely read it out. But yeah, I do have a pair of lefty scissors. And I've owned those for like, what, five years now? It seems like 50-50 right now. I'm upset by that. Yeah, it's a tie. <laughs> you know, you know, by my decree, do we all want to skip it? Do we all want to skip Skyward Sword? Because it's not the best game. That's you. Um, I might do something later, honestly, but uh, hold on, hold on. 
Should I do flight sim? Should I do flight sim and we just talk about the direct? Should we do flight sim? Should we do flight sim? Hmm. I can set up flight sim right away if you guys want me to. Uno? No. Oh, no. You? No. <laughs> no, you. <laughs> Express our rage through cards. Dude, I've had the space heater on for a whole hour, and it's still only 65 degrees in my room. What the fuck? Cool math games? Bruh. Bruh. Oh my god, I haven't played in a long time. <laughs> Can we get some Rositas in here for that? Oh. <laughs> yes, cool math games. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. But yeah, I don't see a point, guys. I don't see a point in uh, getting Scarlet Sword HD. The only game that I saw interest in may buy is uh, Mario Golf. They're, like, if it's actually polished and actually well done for a Mario Golf game, like Advanced Tour was, I may get it. I may get it. I may, I may get Mario Golf. But other than that, there are no other games that I would pay $60 for. And the problem is, is that even with Mario Golf... I don't know if I'd pay I I'd pay sixty dollars for it because honestly, I'd have like it has to be a perfect RPG just like the others. Advanced Store is a perfect RPG. I probably spent an easy hundred and twenty something hours playing it. But but uh yeah, I remember watching. You know how if anybody's played Advanced Store, you know there's a little play timer in the top right screen. Uh, when you go to like settings, I watched that play timer tick over to ninety nine hours. And uh, once it gets over to 99 hours and 59 minutes, it resets to zero. I legit played the game for over 100 hours. Legit played the game for over 100 hours. So I got my money's worth out of it. I don't think I'm going to get that with uh, with a Switch game anymore. I really don't. So I might not pay $60 for it. I might wait for it to go down to half price or something. I, I, I just don't see a point. I really don't. Now, hopefully, they actually provided a discount, but given it's Nintendo, they're going to charge $60 for it. There's no way in hell I'm getting a discount on a on a Nintendo game. Why would I? Nintendo doesn't like you. They don't like you. They never have. They never will. They don't care for the fans. They, when they, Whenever a source code leaks, they hate you for it. They'll try to DMCA you. It's a big fucking, like, big fucking deal, Nintendo. No one likes you. Just because we like your games doesn't mean we like you as a company. And what you're doing right now is pathetic. And that direct was pathetic. Anyways, thank you for coming to my TED Talk. Uh, do we all want to set up a uh, flight sim? Or something else, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I'm very, I'm, I'm very disappointed in this. Very disappointed. Yeah, me either. Hi, Seth. Hello. Did you hear about the dumb shit, uh, the direct retardation? For Smash, yeah. All we got is Pyramithra, and then uh, basically nothing. Could do Pario Marty. Um, I want Mario hmm. Party. If we have four people able to play Mario Party, maybe. <sighs> yeah, my friend who was very enthusiastic about Smash was furious about the new Smash reveal. I'm not <laughs> furious about it. If, if anything, I feel like it was expected. I feel like it was expected. I'm neutral. I'm a little bit, uh, sad about it. Well, how many slots do we have left? Like, four? Uh, Jake mentioned that, uh, they, for the new, for the new thing, it's like two. Oh, uh, which Mario Party? I play six and seven mainly. And, uh, speaking of six and seven, I actually got a bunch of new cheat codes in that balance the games out a lot more than I used to have them. So, uh, we might actually be able to play a very balanced game of six or seven. There's even a, a thing that allows character orbs to be used by all people in seven, which is really nice. Um, so, like, Peach can have a, a fire orb and, and stuff like that. So it's actually, like, really balanced. I don't, care about, I don't care about Smash. I really don't. I don't care about it. It's a very overhyped fighting game. The only thing it, it, we're going to use same dolphin version. Same dolphin version. Same dolphin version. But, yeah. Smash is overhyped, in my opinion. I know a lot of you will disagree. Its fan base is cancer. Um, and uh, like, s s sure, it is a game that helps propel the industry forward as a whole because it's a lot of 
companies working together and meshing together to make a game. And that's what's cool about Smash. The problem is, the fan base and Nintendo's, uh, let's say, respect, respect for online competition gaming is low. So, I think you know where I'm getting at with this. They don't care. All they care about is making money and having Sakurai just do his thing. And because they're letting Sakurai do his thing, they just don't care. They don't. All they do is go like, hey Sakurai, as long as you put in some DLC, some new characters, whoop de doo But yeah, it's, it's pretty mad. Pretty mad. You know what? I'll do a poll here. I'll do a poll here. Which game? Which game you want? MS Flight Sim or Mario Party GC? All right, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna make meme answers, and let's see if anybody gets the references. Uh, what are they? All right, um, you guys have two minutes. Go. Also, why don't you ever play MP8? MP8 requires a Wii mote, and that requires everybody that plays to have one of these suckers, and it requires each of you to hook it up properly. Um, last time I checked, I'm like the only, uh, no offense, no offense to any of you in chat, but, uh, it's, you, you kind of have to know some tech, uh, hacking, or not hacking, but like, you have to be competent enough to, uh, use one of these on a PC. That and you have to have Bluetooth. That and you have to have Bluetooth. Uh, Metopia, don't really care. I can play it on Citra. I don't care. I can literally play the game on Citra for free. And I know some people don't like me saying that, but it's true. You can get it on Citra for free. And, um, not to mention, all the other games were very disappointing. Skyward Sword HD, I can play on Dolphin for free. And I know people don't like me saying that, but it's true. So sorry if that offends you, but, uh, guess what? I don't care. You can play for free. As Gabe Newell said, piracy is a service issue. That's not my quote. That's his. Pario Marty. All right, we're doing Pario Marty. If we do a Mario Party tonight, can we take an hour break before we do so? We need to do some things. Um, I could do 7.30. Find my house and crash a plane to it, please. Um, hmm. I know you're in France, I'm pretty sure, but I don't know where, <laughs> and I don't want to ask. <laughs> I'm not asking. Um, 7.30 works. I don't know, 7 or 6. We'll have to, we'll have to decide. But yeah, four people said Pario Marty, so we're going to do Pario Marty. Yay. Pario Marty. Pario Marty 6 or Pario Marty uh, 11? Pario Marty 11. All right, I sent out a ping for netplay, but yeah, thank you all for uh, thank you all for tuning in. Pario Marty quote, no, but yeah, that was a very disappointing direct. Two out of ten, honestly. No Breath of the Wild two, no Bayo three. All all the shit that we all the like triple A's that we were anticipating that had been retconned or in dev hell, we have heard nothing. We might hear something about Breath of the Wild two later this year, which is good to hear. Thank God, but like. Come on. They didn't even, like... And, and they're literally just throwing us Skyward Sword. They're throwing us a bone, but it's a really crappy bone. It's a really crappy bone. Alright, thanks for stopping in. It's a crappy bone. It's not like when they are making Breath of the Wild and we were like, Okay, we're not able to give you Breath of the Wild yet, so we're going to give you Wind Waker HD. Oh, we're not able to give you Breath of the Wild, so we're going to give you uh, Twilight Princess HD. Those are actually good remasters. They are proper. Skyward Sword doesn't look like that. It doesn't. It looks very disappointing. I will emulate on Dolphin if I do play it. So, yeah. Um, in addition to that, yeah. Mario Golf looks promising. I keep saying this. Mario Golf's promising. I just... I won't be buying it day one until I am confident in it. And once I'm confident in it, be it 
play it early or do something else with it or watch gameplay early, I, I want to make sure it's, it's promising. I want to make sure it's something that I'll actually play it. Because if I don't, then I'm not going to pay $60 for it. I'll just buy it used, like, months later. Honestly. I, I, want, I want to like it. I want to like it. But I don't know if it's going to hold up. I, I really don't know if it's going to hold up. So, who knows. Anyways, thank you all for watching. Uh, if you guys want to talk about the uh, Direct later, I'll be doing Mario Party in the next, like, oh, I don't know. Hopefully hour if people can uh, can get moving. But, um, yeah, thank you all for tuning in. Don't go anywhere, guys. In, like, an hour or two, we'll be playing some Mario Party. So, see you then. Ciao.